Hello everyone, welcome to another motovlog on my channel. My name is Marshall30498. And today's motovlog topic is going to be what normally normally is based upon that is motorcycle topic related. And I want to know from all of my uh, subscribers and people that maybe come across this video uh, for the first time. Uh, I want to know what types of uh, riding do you do your motorcycle on? Do you use it for more commuting? Uh, touring, um, running around town, um, you know, maybe just riding back and forth to work, uh, long trips, uh, maybe some uh, adventure riding only. Uh, just want to know, you know, like what, what I'll use it for and, um, you know, what all you don't use it for. And I'd like to, like to know maybe um, how many bikes you have. You have one bike, two bikes, adventure bike, different genres of bikes, whatever. I primarily use my bike really for uh, everything except adventure riding because obviously a you know 645 pound FJR is not meant to be riding off road other than a gravel driveway and that's fair you know I, but I, I use mine for everything I use it for little short uh, day trips overnight little trips um, you know maybe just uh, 150 150 miles away or so um, you know, uh, stuff like that, just here and there. Uh, hopefully this new GoPro survives uh, a little bit of showers here. Um, if not, I can always pull off somewhere at a gas station, take it off, no big deal. I don't think it's gonna get that wet, but whatever. Uh, sorry to get off topic, but I was just like, what? You know how the weather forecasters are, they never get the weather right at all, so there's that. Uh, but I just wanna know, you know, like what I said, what type of riding you use it for, uh, maybe what you don't use it for um, You know, I even ride my bike back and forth to work. I'll occasionally uh, take it if I've got to just go grab a few things at the grocery store uh, It's not really, you know have to be refrigerated, you know um, Stuff like that You know cuz you know in the warmer months of the year You definitely don't want to put a gallon of milk in a saddlebag even though even if you only live five to ten minutes away it could spoil or you know, some type of meat could spoil between now and then and not be a good thing at all, so. Mm. But, uh, yeah, I, like I said, I use mine for everything. I would rather take this to work to every day and leave the car in the garage, even though, yeah, going in places and, and you know, taking errands and, um, you know, going in places, it's a little bit harder to do on a bike. Of course, you know, you got to take a helmet off and you get back on, you got to put it on, you got the same thing. Um, when you turn around and um, go in every place and it, it doesn't make a little more challenging but it's not something that I mind because I rode now for five maybe even six years and um, I'm just kind of used to it. It doesn't bother me you know what I have to do or what I don't have to do. It's just it's part of motorcycling and I just kind of don't even realize it's even a big deal to me anymore. Um, but those of you, uh, like I said, I want to know what everybody uses their bike for, maybe how long you've been riding, all that kind of stuff. You know, um, my channel now is starting to get, clo get close to 100,000. And um, some videos get a lot of comments from a lot of people. Ron C, he always compliments my video, uh, which is cool. That tells me he's watching pretty much just about every weekly motovlog that I try to upload. So, and that, that's good to know that at least, you know, some of you here and there compliment a lot. I know a guy named uh, Trump, something Tiger Rider. He always compliments on just about every one of my videos too. I have a lot of people like that who compliment on a regular basis, but some never compliment, and then some every so often, maybe that motorblog piques their interest, and then they end up complimenting also. And I'm like, okay, that's cool, but uh, where'd you come from? But I'm always happy to have new subscribers, new people commenting. Uh, I like interacting with, uh, like Ron C has said before, uh, you get to know people and, um, you know, some of the stuff from the comments you can really learn from and, um, some people really, you know, leave cool comments that kind of make you feel good about what you're doing. Even if your channel is on a smaller scale like mine, it makes you feel like all your efforts are worthwhile. So, uh, I don't know. Um, hopefully, sorry, just making sure a GoPro is clean from, even though it's barely raining at all, it did get a few drops in my helmet and a little bit on the windshield um, but like I said uh, I'm just mainly just you know trying to grow the channel trying to do my best to do good uh, you know good content out there now that I've stepped up and went to GoPro Hero A with the mini bod 
and probably really done no kidding that y'all have never seen probably 15 test videos of mic placement um, you know different mic stuff as far as dead cat on uh, or a foam filter on and dead cat on to or even like now I have two foam filters on I found some Amazon that had fantastic reviews for people using them for like a lapel mic for filming stuff outside with like a Canon DSLR and um, I literally have two of them on there now uh, and I use a, a purple panda mic and then I put um, the other foam one on and I play with the mice placement and got it the best I could I even tried adjusting the windshield up just a little bit to not make y'all look through the windshield so much but to help the uh, make the audio that much more clear and I think I got it about perfect now so uh, makes all the hard work pay off uh, but it sure was a struggle with the new setup and I watched stuff about you know different GoPros for months trying to get all the little camera detail stuff sorted out and all that stuff so um, hopefully all my uh, hard work has uh, been appreciated I know I've put a lot of effort into it especially this you know riding season right after Christmas but on that guys uh, that's all I've got for today's moto vlog if you're not already done so please uh, leave a comment down below subscribe if you're not already done so and turn the bell on as most of the time I do upload at least once a week usually Thursday Friday and sometimes a Saturday like this may or might not go up on uh this may be a video from a week or two from now but whatever on that guys thanks for watching ride safe have fun we'll see you on the next one. see ya